Good morning, Los Angeles. The question of the day is, when is historic and legendary also dumb? Hi, I'm Bill Plaschke, sports columnist, Los Angeles Times, and this is your wake-up call. And it was a wake-up call for all of Dodger Nation this week when manager Don Mattingly said that Yasiel Puig's recovery from a hamstring injury had suddenly gotten historic and legendary. He had been out for five weeks, hadn't really done much, and suddenly he's running full speed in Arizona. The question is now, do you bring Puig back for the National League Division Series, which starts next Friday against the Mets, I say no. I say you'd be bringing back a player who hasn't played against major league competition in over five weeks, a player who'd be out of rhythm, a player who'd only played in 77 games all season, hadn't really gotten the rhythm all season long. And by bringing him back, you change the culture of the team. The team is sailing along smoothly right now. You would also have to then have to sideline either Scott Van Slyke or Justin Ruggiano. Ruggiano's been great down the stretch. Van Slyke has about a 380 on-base percentage against left-handed pitching. These guys have been key players for you. I think it would do more harm than good to, to sit them on the sidelines for the Mets series. I think Puig can have great value when he's Yasiel Puig, but he hasn't been Yasiel Puig for a couple years now. People have to get used to that fact. And I think right now to add him to this team would be more of a distraction. The only thing historic and legendary would be if he came back and actually played at full strength in the Mets series. That's not going to happen. Let's just leave Lasiel Puig be for now. You can read us at LATimes.com and follow me on Twitter at Bill Plaschke. Have a great day.